This is our strategy wall, and it helps communicate the way we show our people what really matters and what they can do to contribute to the overall well-being of the company. And it all starts with the principle statements. Uh, these are the principles that we've gotten from the shingle model, which means an awful lot to us. And, and these are the principles that our people really connect with. Lead with humility. Respect every individual. Uh, assure quality at the source, seek perfection, create constancy of purpose, those kind of ideas. Um, these are bedrock for us. And uh, in, in the black letters here, we've kind of written a, a description of what we mean by the principle. And I'm convinced that uh, you go on the floor, you talk to any employee here, uh, I don't know that they necessarily rattle off the principles, but you talk to them about respecting individuals, They'll know what you're talking about, and they'll feel about it the way that we've written about it here. And we try to reinforce this because, because again, we find this is foundational to all of the things that happen. So having the principles, then we decide, well, what is it that we need to have in place in the teams, on the floor, throughout our organization, so that we can support these principles. And that's where we come up with the systems, creating the systems, like we have a coaching and training system. Not surprisingly, uh, the coaching and training supports this idea of respecting individual. It teaches people how to embrace scientific thinking. It helps them understand the importance of seeking perfection. It reinforces constancy of purpose. Uh, all of the different systems help us accomplish the principles. That's why they exist.